the discovery and detonation of improvised explosive devices and the arrest of key suspects can be attributed to the vigilance of the population and response by security forces. These suspects have been connected to the ADF terror group, which is currently being suppressed in DRC under the command of Major General Dick Olum. And um, they, why they are up? It's because they want to divert us from the pressure we have put, them in, uh, put on them in the Congo and then divert us internally. Improvised explosive devices remain a locally manufactured threat that poses a danger to the population. Terrorists have resorted to using such devices due to their inability to import and transport pre-manufactured bombs into Uganda. Ordinary there are things that you would otherwise throw away. These fellows gather them. And they have an impact. If when a nail explodes from pressure, it certainly yeah, the, the nails uh, would kill you, they would maim you. You do not want to test what they can do. The UPDF denies allegations that the increase in the use of IEDs is aimed at restricting the possibility of political gatherings. As an individual, should always be in support of securing the citizens, politics aside, because politics must be played in a secure environment. Um, are we compromised? No. But we are mindful of what Ugandans think, because your opinions matter. According to the UPDF spokesperson, the suspected terrorist primary objective is to generate panic. Komagum Rogers and Ivan Kahawa, UBC News.